Airman First Class Candice Griffin is just one of 50 airmen from the 336 Aircraft Maintenance Squadron doing their part to support the war effort in a big way. I load munitions on the aircraft, anywhere from missiles to bombs and flare and shaft. It's never the same thing every day. It's always something new. The flight line is pretty crazy, so you never know what to expect, but you're always prepared. In an environment where being prepared can mean a difference between life and death, these airmen rush to get the jets in the air as a call for help comes down. What we had was, uh, we had a scramble. In other words, we had some troops that were in contact with the enemy and they needed some air cover ASAP. So we are on alert and we have to get our jets up in the air and over the target within a certain amount of time. And it's that speed and precision that these airmen bring to the fight, saving the lives of U.S. and coalition forces with each aircraft they send down range. It's very important for the guys on the ground because without us, uh, some may not make it home. Most people think of the Army on the ground and they don't realize that air power is the best thing ever and that the Army loves it. So, For the weapons load crew and the aircraft maintainers, it brings a sense of accomplishment every time an aircraft returns in need of armaments. I love seeing the airplanes take off and do their mission and come back with, with no munitions on them. That means that our stuff worked right and someone got saved that day. Another life saved by the 336 rockets. Our job is to put warheads on foreheads. And another chance for someone to make it back home. Reporting from Bagram Airfield, Afghanistan, I'm Staff Sergeant Yoshishin Zado.